Hey guys, Easy Amateur Radio here, back with another part of this series, Cheap HF Radios. So this little orange dude is the True SDX, uh, originally made by DL2MAN and PE1NNZ. This is an HF transceiver. It's pretty much all the HF bands, and it's got a lot of cool features. We'll click through the menus just so you can see them. I'll do a more con comprehensive overview of this radio. This is just first looks at it and what it comes with and everything. I did buy this radio used. I did not buy it brand new, but it's pretty close to brand new. It had all the original packaging and stuff like that. And 9.7 seems to be as far as we can go. Let's get out of the menu. We don't want to change that. It says True SDX right there. Volume has a speaker, an internal microphone, and we'll flip it to the side. On the side right here, it comes with an SMA connector, like a Baofeng, like most cheap radios do. But the person I purchased this from had this BNC adapter on it. And if you're going to get this radio, I recommend sticking a BNC adapter on it. On the side right here, we have two 3.5 millimeter jacks, one for an external speaker and one for a mic, microphone, and a CW key. Uh, actually, scratch that. This is for audio in, audio out up top. This PA over here is for the external speaker, if I remember correctly. And then uh, right here, we have a micro USB, not a USB-C. I think some of the new ones are made with USB-C. I'm not 100% sure on that. Don't quote me and get mad at me. And then up top, we have the power cable. And what you see right here is different from some of the other cheap radios that we have. This is for the USDX, the uh, orange and blue one up top. And so you see the power cable is a little bit different. We'll plug it in it goes back to 40 meters now this radio does boast some ft8 features you can hear the speaker kind of doing its thing we'll go ahead and turn that down uh so this radio does boast ft8 features i have gotten it on ft8 with my original model that i had i sold that one this i purchased this one just for this video this radio, once I get done with this vid cheap HF video series, it's going to go up for sale on the Ham Radio Crash Course Discord and the Toads Discord from Coffee and Ham Radio. Now, they do say there is a firmware now where you can do FT8 off this micro USB. We're going to give that a shot. The last time I had to pipe audio in and out with specially made cables temporarily offline, Steve T.O., he has a video on how to make those cables. But this is the True SDX, and just a little bit of a comparison for you guys. Behind it is the USDX. You can see that the USDX is a little bit taller. You can see the size comparisons. About the same thickness. What I do like about this one is you can print your own case and print different cases. They do make an expansion case for it, uh, where you can put 18650 batteries in it. Let's go ahead and connect this to the um, big meter back there and let's watch it. Now this radio does not come with a microphone. It literally comes with the radio and the power cable. So I'm going to use the PTT back here. We're going to go in the menu and I'm already in FM mode from when I did some earlier testing. We're going to be looking at the uh, at the red 10 watt scale. I do want to go ahead and and we will swap bands. Let's put it on the 10 meter band. See up. Oh. So no. So this radio, excuse me, goes 80, 60, 40, 30, 20. That's what we're getting at. We're gonna try it on 20 FM. We're gonna be looking at the red meter, the red meter in the back. Well, let's see if I can't help you guys out. Get in a little closer there on there. Hello, hello, one, two, three, one, two, three. So you can see on 20 watts, we're about three and a half, four watts. Let's go to 40 and just see what it's got on 40 FM. Hello, 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 audio. So about a watt and a half on FM. And then we'll, uh, just for giggles, we will jump over to sideband on 40 meters and see what that looks like on the meter. I have a feeling it's not gonna look like anything serious. Hello, hello. 
So a little bit of power drop on there. You can see that. Let's try it on 20. Maybe that will jump the, uh, get us the full five watts that this radio claims it will do. Hello. There we go. We got a little bit of swing now to it. Hello. Hello. So yeah, we saw the five watt swing, but uh, nothing super spectacular. This radio, I think, is a better CW radio, maybe a better FT8 radio. On voice, it does have some issues, and there is a microphone that you can build for it. K Adam K6ARK does make a kit for this. We might look at the kit. We might not. I haven't quite decided yet. Uh, for somebody starting out, I like to look at cheap HF radios that come with everything you need to get started. Technically, this comes with everything you need, but... It's not really what I recommend, but hey, the true SDX first look, that's what you get, guys. 73.